and welcome. I just got this beautiful ornament mold from Molds and Shapes. It's gorgeous. And I should be editing videos right now, but instead I'm going to make one because I just can't help myself. And for the pigment on this one, I want to use just paints. Um, I'm still going to use resin. I have about four ounces of that mixed. I'm only going to do the inlays to start. That's just the part that's indented. But I am going to use paint, so I mean, I have some folk art, some jacquard, however you pronounce that. Um, and I also have some spindrift pour paint I might use, I'm not sure yet. And I have a couple of the color shifts. So all I'm going to do is mix those in with my resin. So I'll mix up my pigment, or I will pigment my resin and be right back. I finished pigmenting all of my resin and I'm going to use a syringe since I'm only doing the inlay parts. I'm going to start over here and for this one I'm using the um, white flash color shift by Folk Art as my pigment. I chose purposefully not to go with just a theme and do them all the same because I want to see which one I like the best and then I can go back and do a whole set of those. I'm also not using a needle on the end of the syringe. The inlays on this mold are a lot larger than normal where I would need the syringe. So I'm just using the actual syringe as opposed to the needle. I mixed up some resin with just some silver glitter. I'm going to spritz that. Alright, I'm going to move on to this one. And for this I'm using the Lumiere Halo Blue Gold. And I'm going to follow that with some gold glitter mixed with resin. For the stars, I'm going to start off with silver, and this is the Brush Silver by Folk Art. Now I'm going to use the Spin Drip Pour by Plaid and the colors Flash. And since I'm not using the needle syringe, I'm just using a pointed cotton swab to push this into those points. I'm going to start on the tree now. And this is the Lemire Pearlescent Emerald. I want to put some gold around that star, so I'm just going to use my cotton swab. And on this one, I'm going to use um, the Lumiere Crimson. And again, a cotton swab just to push it. On the last one, I'm using the Folk Art Metallic and Midnight Blue. And we're done. From a time perspective, because I will fast forward through this and not make you all watch this the way I just did it, it took a little over an hour and I have quite a bit of resin left, so probably three ounces would have been more than enough. So I'm going to let this cure, and once it has set, I will be back. This first layer is now cured, and so I mixed up another eight ounces of resin, and I just added some silver glitter, some gold glitter, and then some of this blue flash to the resin 
This one I'm going to use on the snowflake one. And all I'm doing is just back pouring over top of the inlay that I already poured. On this one, I'm just going to go in with clear to see how it looks. On the stars, I'm going to go with the silver glitter. And on the red, I'm going to use the silver glitter. And on the last two, I'm going to use the gold glitter. All right, and now I'll just let that cure and I'll be back when it's time to demold. The ornaments are now cured and ready to demold, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. All right, are we ready? All oh, that turned out beautiful. I love it. Awesome. That turned out cool. I think I would have liked it better if I went with a sparkly back. So, actually, probably cool. Where it would look more like that. But I did want to give it a try and see if I liked it with the clear. It's simplistic. Okay. Well, that turned out really pretty, too. Love it. Now for this one. Oh, that's gorgeous. I actually really like the blue with the gold. Very nice. And this one. Oh, I like that too. It's not very Christmassy to me, you know, shooting star with stars, but it's very cute. And the last one, this one should be the tree. Oh, that turned out good, except for this. I'll go back over that with a oil marker because I filled the back with gold but I put the star as gold so I'll have to change that to something different but that's cute these turned out really well I think these are my favorites over here and these are okay but by far those are my favorites well, I hope you enjoyed the video. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, share, and press the bell to be alerted to future videos.